India and China inked bilateral deals worth $10 billion on Friday. The two countries also agreed to find a solution to the long-standing boundary dispute as Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi completed his second day of China visit. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi was accorded a ceremonial welcome by his Chinese counterpart Li Keqiang in capital Beijing on Friday. Both the leaders also held a delegation-level meeting to discuss a number of bilateral issues. The two countries also entered into 24 bilateral agreements in fields including education, railway, mining, space and maritime cooperation and increasing people-to-people -people cooperation. The neighbours agreed on the importance of resolving the long-standing boundary dispute. On the boundary question, we agreed that we continue to explore a fair, reasonable and mutual acceptable resolution. We both reiterated our strong commitment to make all efforts to maintain peace and tranquility in the border region. Prime Minister Modi also stressed on maintaining the balance of trade between India and China. I had raised on our growing trade deficit. We look forward to early impact on the ground. We have agreed to create a high-level task force to develop a strategic roadmap to expand economic relations the Indian Prime Minister also addressed students of Beijing's Tsinghua University later in the day. After completing his one-day visit to the Chinese capital, Prime Minister Modi left for Shanghai. He is set to meet business leaders on Saturday, the last day of his state visit, which comes as a follow-up of President Xi Jinping's trip to India last year. New Delhi is eyeing at an increase of bilateral trade and more Chinese investment in India. The two Asian giants, which are the biggest markets in the world, have so far not been able to make significant progress in ties, largely due to boundary disputes. The growing presence of China in Pakistan has also been a matter of concern for India. New Delhi has also registered its protest over Beijing's move to invest nearly $45 billion for the China-Pakistan Economic Corridor, which passes through Pakistan-occupied Kashmir.